Hey, what's up, guys? Kaiser here, and you're catching me uh, right after a quick bite. I'm having some fun out here in the city today, and I wanted to get you guys that are just trying our program that are early on some important information about uh, a lot of the stuff that's happening in your first month with us. You know, this is the hardest part. Eventually, it becomes a habit. You know, it's a funny thing that happens in fitness. It's that your body soon starts to ache when you don't work out. Uh, I, I hope you heard me right. That you feel sore, you feel achy, you feel agitated when your body doesn't work out. And those of you that are experienced fitness goers, you know about this already. Those of you that are new, it sounds like I'm lying to you. Well, you know what? Just survive this first 30 days. You're going to see what I'm talking about. Now, when it comes to these first 30 days, I'm sure when it comes to the workouts, one thing you feel... One thing you... Hang on one second, guys. Let me get the, uh, the Havana Libre. Yeah, sure. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, just getting a little uh, drink. Uh, hope you don't mind. So, um, yeah, one thing you're feeling probably is like a fish out of water. That you're like... Um, I don't know what I'm doing. Am I doing it right? And uh, I, the, our trainers are here to correct your form. That being said, it's a group setting, obviously. That's why it's not very expensive. If you want to have any of our trainers uh, train you one-on-one, -on -one, we can give you a bill. Trust me, I'll train you one-on-one. -on -one. I'll come live with you, but that bill might be a big bill. So that being said, you lose a little bit in a group setting. You gain a lot in a group setting. The energy, the environment, the community, the savings and cost, obviously. You lose a little bit. Someone not standing over you like a personal trainer. Well, first off, who the hell needs that anyway? Do you need some guy creeping over you, like looking at everything while you're doing a push-up? No, you don't need that. But your push-up might not be perfect in the beginning. So we're gonna help you, we're gonna teach you, we're gonna call your name out, we're gonna show it to you. But even if I showed you every possible thing when it comes to form, when you're a starter, when you're a beginner, even if you're an advanced fitness goer doing a new fitness regimen, you are, are not gonna get everything right, even if I showed you everything. Unless I physically stood over you, your body is not even used to a lot of these movement patterns. When it comes to a bent over row, keeping your back straight, even holding that position alone is difficult. So you're gonna have to break form a little bit and I hope that you were smart enough to get the lighter weights. When it comes to a push-up, you may have your hands in the wrong place, but you're gonna get fatigued so fast that your hands, that your, your form is gonna start to break regardless. So all these factors, guys, the bottom line is that the proper form stuff shouldn't bother you. That uh, form is obviously very important. That's where injuries happen. But an improper fitness regimen is also where injuries happen. We're not chucking or throwing 100 pound weights here. We're dealing with manageable weights at an intense level, challenge you to, challenging you to the next level. So um, if there are some breaks in form, if you feel like every single thing is not covered, that's not something you need to worry about. Now that's, that doesn't mean letting us off the hook. If your trainers are not watching your form, if they're not looking over you, let me know. But no matter how much we do, no matter how much we look after it, uh, no matter how good we are at our jobs, just with, with a new person just getting acclimated to the program, unless we physically stood over you, uh, that your body just is not used to these movement patterns in the beginning. Survive your first month, get used to the movement patterns, many of them repeat, and then you are gonna find that form almost starts to become second nature. So form is a big part of what we do. It's our jobs, it's our trainer's jobs. The fact that we have large groups, 15, 20, 30 people, that's not a cop-out. That's not an excuse. We still need to make sure every trainer, uh, every trainee, every member is working out safely, effectively, and is, has proper form. Something, some things will fall through the cracks, and even if we had five trainers in there, that would still happen. So gang, uh, I hope in the future, you know, I'm doing a lot of these videos, I'm gonna give you videos that you can study up on your form. If you know your squat is bad, you're gonna be able to learn up on it. Maybe by the time you see this video, that database is already there. But for now, uh, all I have to do is just give the process some time, take it lighter, take it easier, take some breaks, and that form and all the other aspects, all the hundred other aspects, 
that it takes for you to get used to the fitness regimen, they're all going to fall in place. So I hope you're enjoying your first uh, month with us. You're, you're starting out period with us, guys. Don't give up. Hang in there. No one will do it as good as us or treat you as good as us. So just survive this beginning and the rest will take care of itself. That's it for, t that's it for today. And I'll talk to you soon. Take care.